So how do I become a mother baby nurse? This is something that I get asked a lot. So let's start from the beginning. You're gonna need to become a registered nurse. Um, to become a registered nurse, which means that you take the NCLEX, it's the National United States Licensure Exam to become a nurse. Um, you need to get either an associate's degree in nursing or a bachelor's of science in nursing. So first you gotta take your prereqs, which are gonna include all your core classes like math, um, history, a foreign language, all that stuff. You're also going to need to take a lot of science-based classes like anatomy and physiology one and two, um, microbiology, chemistry, statistics, um, all that stuff. And then you, um, you, some programs are a direct admission nursing program, so you can go straight into the nursing program. You get accepted right at the beginning. Um, the one I went to, you had to actually apply to get into the nursing program, and for that, you have to take an entrance exam. Um, so I took the HESI. I took the HESI. I had to submit all of my grades and everything from the prereqs. Um, and I also had to do an in-person interview. So to, when I applied to nursing school, they looked at all those three things. To be competitive, I would say you definitely need kind of a higher GPA. They also look at things like if you have any experience as like a nursing assistant or volunteer work and stuff like that. Um, so once you get into the nursing program, it's going to vary. If it's an associate's degree program, it'll be a little shorter. If it's a bachelor's, most of them are around two years. Mine was five semesters long. Um, so then I graduated. I worked as a um, oncology med surge nurse for um, about a year and a half before I actually transferred and was able to do mother baby. Um, and it just varies. My hospital didn't did not hire new grads straight to mother baby, so that's why I did med surge first. Um, but a lot of places do hire new grads to be competitive, to be hired to mother baby. I usually tell people, um, be persistent in applying. Don't just like apply once and be like, Oh, I didn't hear anything, whatever. Um, be persistent, reaching out to whoever the manager is, even show up in person, bring them a printed out copy of your resume, let them know really why you want to be there. Um, you know, if you can give any kind of personal reason, like I really want to support moms and that's just a passion of mine or whatever but just going into the reasons of why you really want to be there be persistent don't just give up because you get a no once um and yeah keep trying don't give up